when you think about the Predator franchise, um, you can see, I think, um, for me, this the, the, the Predator was interesting because I could see the effort that they had actually put in the movie that they were trying to create, they were actually really trying to create this sort of uh, build the world around the Predators and then like um, incorporate a lot of elements that could work but just didn't. So it was sort of like a valiant effort in a way but um, it just didn't work. Yeah. And that's the shame in it. That's the shame in it. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, but I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm still hopeful. I'm, I'm hopeful that one day they'll be able to make a good alien movie. Mm. That they they'll be able to make a good uh, Predator movie, and they're going to be thing, able I mean, to do a good Terminator movie. Yeah, and I think I, I, I mean, I, because one of the reasons that I liked about this. The latest Predator movie was that you could, like I said before, you could see the effort, and by effort I mean a genuine attempt to understand what makes these movies work. Yeah. They just weren't able to really uh, produce a film that actually works, but I think that's the process that you have to in get yourself involved in if you're making a movie like this. Yeah. You have to really like dissect it. Like what are the elements that you have to have and then you try to build from that a coherent whole and then the problem is always like um, because you have to sort of expand it a little bit so how do you expand it without it without making it sort of ridiculous or like conflating the whole thing yeah yeah I think I think a lot of it is also to do with just simply the I mean, I, I remember a, a, a few years ago, a friend of mine said to me that, that, have you actually realized that all the people who are working in Hollywood, the, the people that we laugh at that are the bad actors, mm. or, like working in daytime soaps or mm. something like that, that actually they're really good at what they do, mm. that it's really, really hard to be a good actor. Yeah. And, the, and the level that's within Hollywood. We're, we're, we've gotten so used to everything being just perfect mm. that when you don't achieve that level of perfection, no. we um, immediately think that it's shit. Yeah. Now, if, you, if, we take that, if we take that into account, to make a really um, well-made <laughs> yeah. working movie is really, really hard. Yeah, it is. Uh, and I think that, that The Predator was... Uh, a, a shining example of something that that had really good building blocks mm. and then just went into enough shambles that it for me it, it came out a really bad movie yeah uh, a lot of it has for me has to do with just miscasting mm. I think that a lot of the people who were in that film shouldn't have been in that film mm. some of it's to do with with the direction that it it was it was poorly paced at mm, times. It was. That there was a there was a good idea behind a lot of the stuff, but then it was, and then uh, some of it was to do with bad choices. Like I wouldn't have, I would never have included a a, a side plot line of a of an autistic boy genius in a Predator movie. Mm. It just for me, it just it's it completely for me it creates something that that this just doesn't fit into this but franchise. But it is an uplifting message. Yes. He is, yes, the, yes. He is the, wor the truest warrior amongst you. Yes, yes. And that's, that's, that, 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 like gives, brain... that gives hope to nerds <laughs> everywhere. But, uh, but it, doesn't, it doesn't create a good action movie. No, that's, no. that's, the, no. that's the problem. And that's the thing. With an action movie, you kind of have to have, when you think about a movie, when it, you mentioned Die Hard, yeah. and it's really, it is true, it moves like a train and it's really streamlined. Yeah. You don't have uh, all these, I mean, when you think about all the locations that the Predator movie had, first it starts in the jungle, and then it's the, like, the suburbs and the, uh, the facility. facility, and then back again to, to the jungle, and it's sort of, it makes for a movie that is so, 
it's sort of hard to follow what is going on there. Yeah. When it should be really, when it, the first one was really simple. It's yeah. the jungle all the way through, and then it, it's, yeah. it's, it's, it's nicer that way. Yeah, and there's, the, the first movie is also interesting because there's, there's really, there really aren't, there's like seven characters in the <laughs> whole movie. <laughs> yeah. Even yeah. though it happens in a war zone, yeah, and there's, yeah. but, but there's everybody else, everybody outside is either corpses yeah. or, or just frightened villagers mm, yeah. or just soldiers yeah. that get shot yeah. immediately. It's, it's a really sort of weirdly compact little movie, except it's a huge blockbuster. Yeah, yeah. Anyway. And I think that works because when you, when you think about Die Hard, it's basically the same thing. Yeah. And um, if you want to make, if, if make a food allegory about it, if you have a dish, I want to make a food. Uh, because I, I, I definitely. <laughs> if you have a dish that yeah. has like, let's say, six elements to it, and all of them really work, yeah. and then you have a dish that's ha that has twenty-five elements to it, it's got to be better. I mean, more is more. <laughs> yeah. He kept on telling me to slow down. You know, I says, "Hey, slow down." I'm like, "Oh, you know, remember, less is more. Less is more." He said, and I always said, "How can that be? How can less be more? It's impossible. More is more." You know, simple, simple logic. But it's, it's, it's more complicated to have all those elements working, working. With, yeah. with each other. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's true. Yeah, it, it is true. And it, I think um, it's hard to keep a blockbuster, especially a, 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 a sequel to a blockbuster, mm. uh, as sort of a tight unit. Yeah. And I think I th they tried to make that with the Predators. Yeah. And they went to the alien planet and there were just these few characters. Yeah. And then Lawrence Fishburne and the Predator and the dogs. Yeah. Yeah. The dogs. Yeah. <laughs> but it again, I, I think in that movie, again, shitty casting. Yeah. yeah. I, I don't know. It, it, it might be interesting to just think about what kind of casting would it what, require. What, yeah. yeah w would require to make a good. I think that, that whoever makes the next Predator movie, if you ever watch this, <laughs> think about the casting first. Yeah. No. I mean, everything else comes secondary because it's it, it's it's so much to do with these people uh, being able to interact with each other and and forming a sort of tight because they are sort of movies mm. that there's always a unit of yeah. people. Yeah. It's never just two people against mm. a predator because it won't it won't work. It's no. just it has to be a lot of lambs to the <laughs> slaughter. Basically, yeah, it's but, funny when you think about the first one. We don't really know that much about any of the other people except for maybe Arnold and um, Carl Weathers. Yeah. But they all work because they're so charismatic. They're so they're simple characters, but you have this sense. They sort of it's weird because they're really simple, but they still have a lot of meat. <laughs> 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 too much, too much meat. Some would say enhanced meat, but but, but without it, working out, <laughs> without working out and without steroids, and. But but the thing is also that that uh, even those characters are only believable. That's also interesting that they're only believable as elite soldiers yeah. in the Hollywood mm, sense. True. I mean, they're trying. For example, in the new movie, if they said that it's rooted in reality, those kinds of guys that were in the Predator, mm. I think, are more believable as being like soldiers. Yeah elite soldiers mm. elite soldiers tend not to be bodybuilders <laughs> no, <laughs> but, no. but but in terms of creating that world and having it sort of seamless you can like you said it's a bad idea to root it in no, reality it is. they they have to be sort of over the top because the predator itself is such an over yeah. the top being whatever mm. guy yeah. space dude. guy <laughs> space dude <laughs>